Perceiving his excellent commitments to the field of material science, Kaku has acquired extensive praise for his accentuation on the progressive prospects presented by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST. This wonderful instrument has made huge headway, including the identification of six massive galaxies that challenge previously accepted scientific theories. These galaxies were once thought to be beyond the capabilities of current research, yet their discovery presents a rare opportunity to expand our understanding of the universe. What makes these discoveries striking is their simplicity, yet they quietly push the boundaries of established theories regarding the formation and evolution of galaxies. It is essential to carefully examine these discoveries, as they highlight the fundamental role of scientific progress in shaping our perspective on the universe. Kaku, a renowned figure in the scientific community, is widely recognized for his vast expertise in classical physics and quantum mechanics. His unique background, bridging American and Japanese cultures, has fueled his strong passion for exploring the new horizons revealed by the JWST. He enthusiastically embraces the insights offered by the telescope, eagerly sharing them with the public and demonstrating his commitment to enhancing humanity's understanding of the universe. His eagerness to engage with these newfound discoveries, which can no longer be ignored, reflects his dedication to advancing human knowledge. Kaku's distinct perspective is evident in his reflections on the JWST revelations, which have reignited his curiosity. Throughout his career, Kaku has been known for his openness to unconventional ideas, welcoming concepts that challenge long-standing beliefs. While he acknowledges the importance of Einstein's theory of relativity and Newton's laws in modern science, he believes these theories do not fully account for the universe's complexity. Kaku argues that the JWST findings could significantly transform the field of cosmology. However, many of his colleagues remain skeptical of this viewpoint. This skepticism has led to debates and criticisms, particularly from proponents of the Big Bang Theory and quantum mechanics. Nevertheless, Kaku remains steadfast in his belief that the JWST has uncovered six gigantic galaxies dating back to the early universe, each of which contains more stars than our own Milky Way. These galaxies formed only 200 to 700 million years after the Big Bang. A group of cosmologists has aptly named these extraordinary galaxies universe breakers, because their discovery challenges current cosmological models. If these findings are confirmed, they could drastically reshape our understanding of the early universe, suggesting that its initial stages were far more dynamic and complex than previously imagined. The dominant theory about the universe's origin suggests that after the Big Bang, the universe was chaotic, with the first solid structures taking a long time to emerge. It was once assumed that galaxies began forming much later. However, the massive galaxies identified by the JWST are already larger than the Milky Way, and their extraordinary brightness suggests they may have been producing stars at a rate much faster than our own galaxy. In contrast, the Milky Way forms stars at a slower, more unpredictable pace. While the exact timeline for the formation of the earliest cosmic structures remains unclear, it is evident that the early universe may have begun with isolated stars or small clusters of stars that eventually merged into larger systems. For a long time, it was believed that such massive, mature galaxies could not have existed so soon after the Big Bang. This raises a fundamental question. Is the universe older than we thought, or did these massive galaxies form much earlier than expected? This idea presents a significant challenge to conventional scientific understanding, which still struggles to reconcile these new discoveries with established models. Some areas of physics have even dismissed these findings, questioning the accuracy of age estimates. However, Kaku is well aware of these criticisms and has openly expressed his stance on the issue. He points out that many outdated theories persist due to the influence of prominent scientists, even though later research has disproven them. Kaku emphasizes that true scientific progress comes from experimentalists who focus on rigorous and precise theories. He also highlights that humanity's understanding of the universe's origins remains incomplete, underscoring the need for continuous testing, revision, and refinement within the scientific process. The concept of the universe's origins was first introduced in 1927 when scientists discovered that the universe is expanding, suggesting it originated from an infinitely dense point and has been growing ever since. At the time, the idea of a universe with both a beginning and an end seemed unfathomable to many. Even today, science still struggles to fully grasp this concept. Nevertheless, it is crucial to remain open to such possibilities, even when new discoveries challenge long-established scientific beliefs. History has shown that scientific understanding is always subject to revision. For example, in Einstein's youth, 
it was widely accepted that stars and planets held fixed positions in space. Today, we know that everything in the universe is in motion. Planets orbit stars, stars move through galaxies at enormous speeds, and entire galaxies drift through space with their ultimate fate uncertain. This realization has overturned centuries-old beliefs and reinforces the necessity of continuous scientific inquiry and adaptation. Today, scientists must embrace anomalies and recognize that theories are never fully complete until they undergo rigorous testing and validation through observational data. The Big Bang Theory, for example, emerged from observations that galaxies are moving away from us, with their distances proportional to their separation from Earth. This theory, known as Hubble's Law, was further supported by evidence such as cosmic microwave background radiation and the redshift of distant galaxies. However, it is essential to remember that, in the past, People believed the Earth was flat and that the Sun revolved around it, ideas based on the best available evidence of their time. Technological advances have since revolutionized our understanding of the universe. We now find ourselves in a similar situation, as new data from the JWST challenges some of our previous assumptions. This situation illustrates the ever-evolving nature of science, where experts must remain open to new findings while re-evaluating established theories in light of emerging evidence. The remarkable discoveries from the JWST challenge our current cosmological understanding, prompting a reassessment of long-established models. Universe Scientists rely heavily on redshift measurements to estimate the distance and velocity of celestial objects. Redshift refers to the shift in light's color as the source and observer move relative to each other. For example, when a distant light source, such as a star, moves away from us, its light shifts toward the red end of the spectrum. Conversely, when it moves closer, the light shifts toward the blue end. This phenomenon provides essential data on the motion and distance of galaxies. However, even minor errors in redshift measurements can lead to significant consequences. As a result, many traditional evaluation methods are now under scrutiny due to the new revelations made by the JWST. These new discoveries urge scientists to reconsider whether these results could be attributed to errors in redshift measurements or if some researchers are overlooking current data. This question demands careful analysis and thorough review of both the data and the methods used. Ongoing assessment is vital, reflecting the growing recognition within the scientific community that persistent inquiry is key to advancing our understanding of the contemplations and criticism in the remarks segment underneath. On the off chance that you partook in the content, Please like, share, and subscribe to stay updated on future videos. Your viewership is extremely valuable, and we anticipate seeing you again soon. This call to action invites viewers to engage with the content, fostering a community of curious minds eager to explore and comprehend the latest scientific breakthroughs. The continuous investigation of our universe, with its vast distances and complex structures, continues to astonish and challenge scientists worldwide. From early cosmological theories to the latest discoveries made possible by cutting-edge technology, each new finding reshapes our understanding and pushes the boundaries of human knowledge. One of the central questions in cosmology revolves around the origins and evolution of galaxies, immense collections of stars, gas, dust, and dark matter held together by gravity. Understanding how galaxies form and evolve is crucial for unlocking the mysteries of the universe and testing established scientific theories. For instance, the Big Bang Theory, proposed nearly a century ago, suggests that the universe began as an extraordinarily dense point and has been expanding ever since. This idea emerged from observations of the expanding universe and the cosmic microwave background radiation, the remnants of the early universe's energy and light. However, recent discoveries, particularly those made by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, have raised questions about certain aspects of the Big Bang Theory. With remarkable sensitivity, the JWST has identified galaxies that appear far larger and more developed than expected for their age. One such discovery includes six massive galaxies that formed between 200 and 700 million years after the Big Bang, an exceptionally brief period in the universe's 13.8 billion year history. These galaxies, referred to as universe breakers by the research team, challenge conventional theories since they are already so large and luminous at such an early stage in the universe's development. The discovery of these galaxies raises fascinating questions about the rapid evolution of the early universe and challenges existing models of galaxy formation. Traditional theories suggest that galaxies form gradually over billions of years through the merging of smaller systems and the accumulation of gas and stars. 
The presence of these massive galaxies so soon after the Big Bang suggests a much more complex and possibly faster process of galaxy formation than previously believed. Moreover, this discovery highlights the crucial role of technological advancements in reshaping our understanding of the universe. The JWST's ability to peer deeper into space and capture faint light from distant galaxies has provided astronomers with invaluable new insights into the early stages of galaxy formation. These discoveries have significant implications for cosmology, prompting scientists to reassess and refine existing models to better explain the complexity and diversity of galaxies observed across vast time scales. These findings underscore the dynamic nature of scientific knowledge, where new discoveries spark further breakthroughs and open new avenues of inquiry. As scientists continue to analyze data from the JWST and other observatories, the study of galaxy formation remains a rapidly evolving field. Each new discovery brings us closer to understanding the fundamental processes that shaped the universe as we know it today. As our understanding of galaxy formation continues to progress, we are beginning to uncover deeper insights into the processes that shaped the cosmos. The study of the early universe is no longer confined to theoretical models or distant projections. It has become a dynamic field of research fueled by state-of-the-art technology. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its unparalleled ability to capture data from the farthest reaches of space, is enabling scientists to revisit long-held theories and explore new areas of inquiry. The newly discovered galaxies, dubbed Universe Breakers, challenge our understanding of how galaxies emerged and how quickly they may have evolved after the Big Bang. These massive galaxies are larger, more developed, and more luminous than previously expected at such an early stage of the universe. As researchers study these galaxies, they are compelled to reconsider the mechanisms behind galaxy formation and how rapidly these processes may have occurred in the universe's infancy. The implications of these discoveries extend far beyond cosmology, they have the potential to reshape our understanding of the universe's development. Overall, the debate surrounding these findings highlights the inherent uncertainty within scientific exploration. Despite the groundbreaking nature of the JWST's discoveries, many questions remain unanswered. Science must confront the possibility that traditional models of galaxy formation and evolution may need to be entirely reconsidered. The new data forces us to confront difficult questions about the timeline of the universe's development and whether our previous assumptions about cosmic growth and evolution were based on incomplete or flawed models. Moving forward, it is essential to recognize that science is an ever-evolving field, always open to new ideas and possibilities. The JWST's discoveries serve as a reminder that the scientific community must remain flexible, willing to challenge long-held beliefs, and adapt to new evidence. Scientific progress is driven by the willingness to revise outdated theories in response to new data, and the discoveries made by the JWST exemplify how a single breakthrough can prompt a re-evaluation of the fundamental principles of our understanding. One of the most exciting aspects of the JWST's discoveries is the potential for future breakthroughs in our understanding of the universe's very structure. The telescope's ability to peer deeper into space and capture light from galaxies billions of light years away has opened up new opportunities to study the universe's earliest moments with unprecedented detail. The data gathered from this research will help scientists refine their models of galaxy formation, investigate the role of dark matter and dark energy in shaping the universe, and gain deeper insights into the forces that govern cosmic evolution. At the same time, these findings emphasize the necessity of collaboration between scientists from various fields. Astronomers, astrophysicists, and researchers from different disciplines must work together to interpret the data provided by the JWST and ensure that these discoveries are integrated into our broader understanding of the universe. The complexity of the cosmos demands a multidisciplinary approach, and the JWST's discoveries are a perfect example of how scientific collaboration can lead to significant breakthroughs in our understanding of the universe. As scientists continue to analyze data from the JWST, they are also refining the tools and techniques used to measure and interpret cosmic phenomena. The precision required to study galaxies that formed billions of years ago is immense, and each new discovery drives researchers to improve their methods and update their models. This continuous process of refinement ensures that science remains a rigorous and self-correcting field, where new discoveries lead to an ever-deepening understanding of the universe. As we continue to explore the cosmos, the discovery of these massive galaxies will undoubtedly spark new questions and hypotheses that will guide future research. Will the discovery of these universe breakers change the way we think about galaxy evolution, or even the fundamental structure of the universe itself? Only time will tell. However, one thing is certain, 
the discoveries of the JWST have reignited our curiosity and opened new frontiers in the exploration of the universe. The revelations made by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, are not just redefining our understanding of galaxy formation but are also prompting broader discussions about the fundamental laws governing the universe. If galaxies formed and evolved more rapidly than previously thought, it suggests that our current cosmological models may need significant revisions. One of the biggest implications of these discoveries is the potential reconsideration of how structures in the universe emerge. The standard model of cosmology, which relies heavily on dark matter and dark energy to explain the universe's expansion and large-scale structure formation, might require adjustments. If galaxies formed so quickly after the Big Bang, it could mean that either the universe's matter distribution was different from what we assumed, or that the physical laws governing early galaxy formation allowed for faster growth. The Role of Dark Matter and Dark Energy in Galaxy Formation Dark matter, an invisible yet gravitationally influential substance, is thought to play a crucial role in galaxy formation by acting as a gravitational scaffold for visible matter to accumulate around. However, the presence of fully formed massive galaxies so early in the universe's timeline challenges our understanding of how dark matter influenced early cosmic structure formation. Additionally, dark energy, believed to drive the accelerated expansion of the universe, could have affected how quickly galaxies could grow. If these early galaxies formed at an unexpectedly rapid rate, scientists may need to reconsider how dark energy and dark matter interacted during the first billion years of cosmic history. The JWST's Unprecedented Capabilities The JWST's ability to detect faint infrared light from galaxies billions of light years away is unparalleled. Unlike the Hubble Space Telescope, which primarily observes in the visible and ultraviolet spectrum, JWST specializes in capturing infrared light. This capability allows it to peer through cosmic dust and observe galaxies that were previously hidden from view. By detecting galaxies that existed just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang, JWST is offering an unprecedented glimpse into the universe's infancy. These findings provide a new window into how galaxies formed, merged, and evolved under conditions vastly different from those we see today. Revisiting the Timeline of Cosmic Evolution The discovery of the universe breakers suggests that the first galaxies may have formed much earlier than we assumed. This, in turn, raises questions about the formation of the first stars, known as Population 3 stars, which are theorized to have been massive, short-lived, and composed almost entirely of hydrogen and helium. If these early galaxies were already well-developed within a few hundred million years, it implies that star formation may have begun even sooner than expected, potentially requiring a revision of our cosmic timeline. Furthermore, the presence of heavy elements in these early galaxies suggests that supernova explosions and other high-energy processes were already well underway, meaning that early galaxies underwent rapid cycles of star formation and death. This contradicts some models that predicted a more gradual buildup of heavier elements over time. What comes next? The discoveries made by JWST are just the beginning. Future observations will focus on studying more early galaxies, measuring their compositions, and determining whether they follow expected patterns or continue to challenge our theories. Upcoming space telescopes and collaborations with ground-based observatories will help refine our understanding of how galaxies evolved and whether our current models need further revision. Additionally, astronomers will analyze whether these unexpected findings could indicate entirely new physics. If fundamental assumptions about how galaxies form and evolve prove incorrect, it could lead to revolutionary shifts in our understanding of gravity, quantum mechanics, and even the very nature of space and time. The Bigger Picture Science thrives on discovery and the willingness to question long-standing ideas. The JWST's findings remind us that no scientific theory is beyond revision. As new data emerges, our understanding of the universe will continue to evolve, forcing us to refine or even rewrite our most fundamental theories. As we move forward, collaboration between astrophysicists, cosmologists, and data scientists will be essential in interpreting the vast amounts of data collected by JWST. The telescope has already reshaped our understanding of the early universe, and it is likely to continue revealing surprises for years to come. The question now is, what else will JWST uncover? Will we find even more ancient galaxies that further challenge our models? Could there be unknown forces or mechanisms at play in the early universe that we have yet to understand?